designed to facilitate employers who, for example, less than 70 per cent of turnover of a previous year and so on and, and rates. Uh, and you deliberately distort uh, what is actually a very effective and unprecedented intervention in the labour market to protect employers, to protect enterprises and to protect workers. And as I said to you, 350,000 is expected will benefit from that scheme. Can you not acknowledge that? Can you not acknowledge that a very substantial intervention has been made, unprecedented, by the state, by the taxpayer, in supporting employment? Why do you see, feel this need always to distort and always to try and, 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 and sort of, uh, if you like, uh, smear people who are definitely trying to do their best? Because you do it for political advantage all of the time. time is up and, you don't do, and in terms of pandemic unemployment payment, we, want, we extended it out f f quicker than any other European country in terms of out to the middle of next year. Uh, we've made that decision. Yes, the, the rates have come down, but they're closely proximate to what people would have been earning yeah. before I they were laid off. Patient, and also it's open now for the first time again with to new entrants and to seasonal workers. And finally, you know the Low Pay Commission is not a government, is not the government. It's an independent statutory. You know that. Yet you came in here again this morning trying to pretend that the Low Pay Commission is an arm of government. It is not an arm of government. It is an independent body set up by this Oireachtas, including you. But when it suits you, you want to make political charge after political charge and not deal with reality. Thank you very much. Sorry, it's a I just have to say, I know we don't have a point of order.